So it is knowingly that I am bored right now so I'm talking normal into this microphone and hopefully it catches up. Hopefully you could hear this video but this is my second video that I am experimenting with and trying to have a little bit of fun and be creative and so just experimental is up in the air right now so uh, but I want to talk about in this video is the second part of my first video this is a reaction video or a feedback video that uh, I wanted to uh, follow up and relay into this second video to um, explain what I want to talk about about in internet email abuse that has been happening for about four years to me and uh, this guy from Finland from overseas just does not get it because he's a borderline sociopath who is um, I, I don't know very force very forcing very controlling and will do anything to get my attention and um, so I whenever he does this to me I just look the other way and I ignore just like and it hurts him the most when I ignore him because this bullshit does not mean anything to me to be straightforward and you know that's what that's all about because I explained it earlier in my first video but um, I just oh what sorry wrong one start it again I just want to uh, go more in depth in my email to direct messages from this guy and so I just kind of wanted to open up these emails read them and give my feedback or my opinion what I think of these emails we will probably focus on email abuse because that is direct and very obvious messages so here is email abuse. Come on. Okay, computer is being slow. Okay, there you go. So yeah, I just want to be direct and obvious that Mika or some party, third party fucking bullshit sending this uh, illicit unsolicited emails so yeah look Lila is a name that I know that Mika knows because that is the name of his grandmother who is suffering from dementia so I mean this guy just throws in uh, random obvious names to portray certain messages or certain people so yep so we'll open one of these why did you not come here? He's trying to get my attention. Um, still, did you forget me so quickly? Mika, let me tell you, I forgot about you four fucking years ago. I do not know why you fucking act like a crackhead or a cluck just to do your predatory action just because you want to send bullshit my way and I will read again did you forget me so quickly the answer is yes four years ago um do you want to kiss you answer me uh no fuck you Hello, please answer me. I'm waiting your message. And look, like I was saying in the first video, random, uh, numerous, different, strange um, algorithms or uh, patterns of 
and between combinations of different letters and different numbers. Can you call me? Fuck you, no I can't. What's wrong? I fucking hate and I fucking despise you. I do not want to be with you. How many times in those same words, the same story, I will tell you over and over again. What don't you fuck not get? You fucking senile fucking monster that you fucking want to force women just because you want them to be with you. Fuck you and fuck off. Of course, don't ignore this. Hey, T Luna6578. I want to talk to you. Answer me ASAP. This was four days ago. So each day I fucking get numerous uh, obvious messages in my inbox from this fucking guy. Same thing, just tell me why. Uh, uh, I got pissed off at this one. It says, do you love me? Email me. From Alessandra. And my response to this fucking email. Fuck you, douchebag. I'm repulsed by you. So... I fucking hate this annoying bullshit. Test, please answer me. I'm waiting for your, your response. Do you want to fuck? No, I don't. And if he sends a different format in text, it's the same fucking thing. Who are you? Retarded bullshit. I, hi, I found your postal address in my book. Tunnel of fucking spoofed emails. <clears throat> Excuse me. Damn it, more of fucking bullshit. Help me. Hey, please respond. I'm waiting you. Kind of obvious this message seems dangerous. Does it look safe? No, it fucking doesn't. It fucking goes on for over four fucking years. These ones need to be in nail products. So I'll put that there. I missed you. I call you yesterday, but don't answer. Do you, do not you want to speak with me? Fuck you. Some more. I'm just gonna go through every fucking single page seriously because I have 867 video or fucking emails from this fucking psychopath. Hello, please answer me. I'm waiting your message. One after a fucking other, after another, and a fucking other. And another, and another. Fucking bitch. And look, this guy tries to get like he's pissed off at me because I don't fucking pay attention to him. Bastard, where's my money? Fuck you. Get off your fucking lazy ass and go get a job. Uh, I want to sleep with you.
and then he fucking has the fucking nerve to fucking send me a request for me to get married to him which is a total rejection and fucking obviously send it inappropriate language to my fucking email ah this is fucked I hate this bullshit I hope you can talk. Salute my my splendid sir opportunity. Let's small talk house. So I am top grade girlfriend living in Kazakhstan. Now I'm trying to find righteous gentlemen. This is my email for reply. And fucking an email did I not know and I'm going to reply you my pictures. So, I mean, this fucking guy just keeps on and on and on. Uh, <clears throat> excuse me. Sorry about that. Just got to clear my throat so I can talk clear. This is going down the tunnel. I saved every fucking single email, you fucking bitch. Karma is gonna fucking throw it back in your fucking face and it's gonna fucking scar you for life, bitch. Seriously. Now he wants to get, call me a fucking jerk because I don't want to fucking respond to him. You jerk don't want to answer my question while I'm coming. Ooh, I'm fucking scared. Yeah, fucking right, dude fucking the gun pistol looking at your face just for my protection do not fucking trespass I mean what satisfaction does this guy get out of this because it doesn't make sense and it's very immature and it's very disruptive and uh, this guy does not have anything going on good in this life his life must be so fucking boring just to create bullshit like this just to send harm's way to females online which is not fucking cool which is a federal sexual offense and it's very illegal and uh, yes I have all this evidence saved against you um, like I said, I've always fucking ignored your ass and I really didn't care to pay attention to you because it really didn't fucking matter what you were trying to fucking say or send because it was not fucking important to me. Seriously, you gotta think about that. I'd be fucking killing your ass all over the damn place and slaughtering you with my fucking axe with fucking chopping these fucking decapitations because enemies try to send bad shit towards my energy field and the only response is to fight back for my fucking freedom because I will never let no fucking man fucking try to control me or try to enforce me into Well, you fucking know what I'm talking about. But look at this bullshit. Anna, Anna is a fucking chick that he fucking knows. Which I do not give a fuck about. So you send obvious names to portray messages of certain obvious people. To portray, to send um, messages. Yeah, so. Yeah, look. Uh, I do not fucking care for that bullshit. Did not care at all. Does not even got one fucking nerve to even fucking comprehend or to fucking accept that seriously because you know what that is extremely offensive and uh you know they say that fucking um it is just war and complete fucking uh battle against against the enemy and um 
Basically, I will knock you on your fucking brain and I'll fucking explode your fucking head. If I had the chance. Just to cure a torture tactic. Because, I don't know. I'm just fucking repulsed by this. Oh, god damn it. Fuck. More bullshit. So, I don't know. I am just going to keep it silent for right now. I'm just going to go on with this video and just bring up the pages, show you the numbers. very very offensive to me why are you cyber stalking me I owe you nothing yeah so this emails really do fucking t take a toll on my fucking anger I'm fucking totally disturbed by this um there's a little bit of stuff that I need to delete here so I'll delete those I don't have no use for those okay sorry that was a mistake that's not supposed to be on there I'll delete those um still um I gotta do a little bit of editing in this one but yeah okay so I should have edited that, but it's okay. I'll just keep going. So every time I get a message with these fucking, uh, freaking, I don't know what the fuck, these short word fucking verses that does not make sense. Um, it's just totally something that I would reject and... Yeah, I'll just keep scrolling down. Six oh one to six fifty. Definitely a borderline fucking personality, fucking retarded, fucking reject in his mind. You know, it's just so fucking senile and does not make sense to me so I just totally disregard this well that's your fucking problem I do not fucking miss you at all get the fuck over it your fucking little fantasy in your head about me cause it's not fucking true and you haunt yourself in your mind because you put all these fucking images in your mind and pictures in your head of probably how I look like or my pictures or you fucking obsessed over fucking nothing it's a really awful situation that you create malice and blackmail and uh, unsolicited messages uh, total fucking This just fucking annoys the hell out of me. So, I just let him fall all over himself. It does not fucking mean a thing to me. So, this guy is just obviously a fucking, um, you know, just a fucking sociopath that has nothing going good for him because. All he wants to do is fucking get drunk and fucking drink up his ass and fucking, um, I don't know what kind of little drunk fantasy he has in his head about me, but obviously you can fucking tell by these fucking emails that are coming in. So, yeah, this guy has probably of the IQ, probably around, say, maybe around a 12-year-old that is, uh, trying to get his ex-girlfriend back because she broke up with him. And it sounds like fucking kindergarten letters that you fucking send in school. So, 
Um, as far as I know, I've researched IC3.gov, which is an internet internet complaint center. Um, it's the FBI for reporting um, illegal international email that are trying to scam you, or if you have a ex that is stalking you online. And I just wanted to show you these examples of what I have been dealing with for the past four years. So, um, so actually, I'm going to do a research on uh, to locating the IP address where these emails are originating from, analyze the email headers, and um, just uh, making my reports to IC3.gov. Uh, get make a police report from Albuquerque. Uh, try to get a hold of dis the district attorney so I could file a complaint and talk to my doctors about this situation because this is very abusive and it's so uncalled for, so fucking unnecessary. And, and um, you are just a fucking uh, worthless guy that is. Uh, just a reject and you cannot accept rejection from women so you gotta act in your childish manner just for me to fucking notice you which I just neglect because fucking the way you act is not fucking anything important to me so just fuck off and you will learn the hard way and you will learn your fucking lesson when you see me with another guy and when you are in trouble with the cops you will learn that you will regret you ever fucked around with me. Now, look at this. Who is in something like this?